Um, your opponent, what did you say to him at the end there? I felt a bit sorry for him. He was a young kid coming through. Yeah. He's got a fantastic long game on him, that's obvious. Mm. What were you saying at the end? I didn't say nothing to him. He just said to me, he said, the tables, he said, they play so differently. And they do, you know, he's obviously just playing on the academy uh, in Sheffield and getting the odd few matches. And they just react so differently, so it's... Um, there, was, there was one stage, you know, I don't know which one it was. Oh, this was one. That's when you, you were shot. laughing, What a it? shot. I mean, look <laughs> at this. This is like... I mean, Judd Trump would have been proud of that. Yeah, that's extreme, that's wasn't it? That's a beauty. He's got something, hasn't he? Yeah. He's, I mean, I said in commentary, you know, Ronnie, that I thought... He's a very good cueist. He knocks in balls. He can yeah. do certain things. His cue ball was all over the shop. Mm. Um, playing someone... Probably highlighted playing O'Sullivan, really, you know, Ronnie, because his cue ball is always on, on a string, if you like. Mm. So that's a, what he's got to learn, isn't it? It's yeah, it's just, yeah, just getting, you know, you've got to have cue ball control, you know, on these tables. Yeah. Otherwise, it just, it's like trying to go, and, like us trying to go and putt on maybe Augusta. You'd just, you'd be there all day trying to get the yeah. ball in the hole, you know. It's more like, as we spoke about earlier, that the younger players, they've got to learn what, what the, the correct shot is. It's not execution so much because he can see that he can hit the ball properly. Mm. They just choose the wrong shot and it puts them behind the eight ball yeah. almost I, literally. I just sometimes, sometimes think it's because they haven't. There isn't a good amateur game about yeah. these days. I mean, exactly. when we were growing up, I was, was playing against top players, and you got you got learned by getting punished as an amateur, mm. junior amateur. When there, it's like they just throw amateurs in with pros, and they haven't got a clue, honestly. Some and you can't. Are you saying you can't learn because you're thrown in at the deep end, and you've got well, you to ha you have to well. learn at some point. But I mean, I think it's better to learn on an amateur circuit, learn your craft, and then you're good enough to kind of you got an, at least you got an idea when you come yeah. into the program. Doesn't could, mean you could it be it. damaging then? Do you think for players that constantly come in the first round and keep getting? Booted? Well, no, it's all good for us because you know it's like um, it's like playing, fighting a boxer who just keeps swinging punches from everywhere. You, think, you don't know what he's going to do next. Whereas if I played Alan or I played John Higgins, I know what shot he's going to play. With these guys, you leave them a shot and they're just sort of like, they'll just smash one in from everywhere. Balls, balls going all over the gaff and you think, it's like attention all pockets, you know, because one might drop in. It's like a game of crash down the club sometimes. Mm. You think, oh, mate, you know, I mean, it can become a bit hard work if you start missing. And then you think, oh, you know, and then they end up putting balls and beating you. You think, what happened now? <laughs>